but like let's just say you had a friend who's a venture capital and over coffee is like hey i've been hearing about this quantum computing thing what's the deal is it a thing is it not a thing when will it be a thing i know i know the when will it be a thing is a very controversial yeah question. i think from an investing point of view it would most likely come back to the whole um, who gets there well there are two questions one is who gets there first but the second is as of now Pretty much all companies are taking a different route at the hardware level. Someone is doing superconducting, some Microsoft is doing topological uh, qubits, uh, then we have ion trapped. So everyone is sort of trying different architectures. So the question becomes like, yeah, is it, it's not just about who gets there first, but it's also about once you get there, are you able to scale it up such that you can, you can make bigger and bigger computers? Because that's what we need at the end of the day to to make it useful for the applications that we have in mind. So yeah, the I think it would come down to is can one identify, uh, like from a technical point of view, which one of these architectures are sort of the most uh, appealing and they have the most uh, promising future. Uh, I think to me that's what it comes down to.